modern bears are classified in the family Ursidae in the mammalian order Carnivora. But not all modern bears are equally related to each other. And so the family Ursidae is divided into a number of subfamilies. Most bears are classified in the subfamily Ursinae. But there are two other subfamilies, including the subfamily of the short-faced bears, Tremarctinae. In Europe, Asia, and North America, 11 million years ago, in the middle of the Miocene, a bear genus Indarctos existed, which is thought to perhaps have given rise to the subfamily Tremarctinae which by 10 million years ago had produced the genus Plyonarctos in North America, Europe, and Asia, which would survive till around 3 million years ago. 5 million years ago, another genus had appeared, Tremarctos, uh, which produced two species that we know of, uh, one that lived in Florida and became extinct recently, and one which moved to South America uh, to produce the modern spectacled bear. Two million years ago, this lineage produced another bear, which would survive until about 11,000 years ago, Arctotus. It is only known in North America, and it was enormous, standing up to six feet at the shoulder, and perhaps 12 feet while standing, and weighing as much as 2,000 pounds. It was long-legged and would have been a more rapid runner than modern bears and would have been an apex predator in North America. The fusion of North America and South America allowed these short-faced bears to travel to South America and a million years ago the largest bear ever had evolved, Arctotherium. It uh, was found in Central America and from there migrated to South America, where it could weigh more than 3,500 pounds. At 1,000 pounds heavier than the largest polar bear, it would have been the largest mammalian terrestrial predator of all time.